Thank you for joining us as we present this video guide to using the Stud Pro Lite XI Stud Welder. Please understand this video is not a substitute for the manual. Please read and understand the entire manual before proceeding to weld with the unit. Thank you for purchasing the Stud Pro Lite XI Portable Pin Welder. We believe you'll be very pleased with its performance. As you unbox your welder, you will find the following items. The welding unit, accessories, tools, manual, foot piece and leg assembly, AC cord, ground cable assembly, and gun cable assembly. Connect the stud gun weld cable into the gun terminal socket on the side of the welding unit. Please note the cable has an end plug which has a flat, which aligns with the dot on the panel mount socket. Secure the connector into the panel mount socket, and then turn it clockwise until it locks into proper position. Failure to do so could result in damage to the connector. Connect the weld gun control cable into the center panel two pin socket. Please note the plug has a large pin and a small pin that match the socket on the unit. Push the plug firmly into the socket and twist clockwise to secure the plug into the correct position. Insert the AC cord into the AC cord socket. Note the on off switch and circuit breaker locations. Setting the gun up for cup head pins, take the Euro to be colored adapter, insert it into the gun shaft, and tighten the retaining nut. Loosen the adapter's small set screws enough to insert the magnetic chuck into the adapter. Once inserted, tighten the set screws snugly. To complete the setup, rotate the spring preload knob located at the back of the gun counterclockwise until it stops. When shooting cuphead pins, you'll want to employ a technique called floating the gun. We want to compress the gun shaft to the center of its travel. We want to avoid compressing the gun shaft completely. You can see the technique demonstrated here. To set the gun up for weld pins, install the Euro to B collar adapter as shown. Next, insert the B-collet into the adapter and tighten the set screws snugly. Once the B-collet is installed, place the collet protector over the B-collet and secure as shown. To complete the setup, adjust the spring pressure preload knob to indicate position 2. To apply weld pins, fully insert the weld pin through the tip of the collet protector. The weld pin will engage the collet inside the protector. Use the floating technique as demonstrated here. Apply moderate pressure to compress the gun shaft, but do not compress the shaft fully. Depress the trigger when you are ready to weld. To secure insulation after applying weld pins, use washers as shown. Once weld pins are trimmed, the sharp point can be covered by installing a dome cap, as demonstrated. Shooting weld studs requires the use of a collet. First, make sure you have the correct collet for the stud. Insert the collet into the gun shaft until it bottoms. Then, tighten the retaining nut until snug. Please note that failure to tighten this properly will result in damage to the gun shaft and collet. Adjust the footpiece to achieve 1 8 of an inch of stud stick out past the footpiece. To set the gun up for acoustical pins, install the Euro to B collet adapter. Then, install the acoustical pin B collet, which is specially designed for the application. Next, install the footpiece assembly, insert the acoustical pin into the collet, 
and adjust the footpiece assembly to achieve 1 8 to 3 16 of an inch of pin stick out. Please note the fan opening in the case. Avoid blocking the opening which would restrict airflow. Our touchscreen controls allow you to access the many features of the Stud Pro Lite XI. Here we see the stud counter, SAE and metric welding presets, and the ability to fine tune the weld voltage. Here from left to right we have a cold weld, a correct weld, and a hot weld. Proper surface prep is essential to getting good, consistent welds. Be sure to sand or grind rusty or painted surfaces so you are welding onto clean, shiny metal. Collet condition is paramount to getting quality welds. This collet is missing its O-rings. Using loose, worn, or damaged collets can lead to arc damage of the studs. We here at Stud Welding Products hope you found this video helpful. If you would like more information, please visit our website at studweldprod.com or give us a call at 1-800-252-1919. Thank you for watching.